Whoa, what in the world? Something is wrong. 85 bucks reduced price for Lucky Bottoms. I wonder what happened to him that he's only 85 bucks. That's half price. Half price for half a body. Maybe it's because he doesn't have a butt. And under Mr. Buttless, we have the full Monty. All you young children won't get that one, but your parents will. Alright guys, today we are in Maryville, Tennessee at Foothills Mall and what has been bestowed upon my eyes but the pennies from heaven. We are at a spirit Halloween that is in an abandoned JC Pennies. I'm not even kidding. Look at this. The old penny sign is lurking behind the haunted trees. And I have to say, this is the most awesome entrance to a spirit Halloween that I have ever seen. Look at this, guys. That is an awesome entrance if I've ever seen one. Is the spookiness behind door number one, door number two, or door number three? I choose door number three. Oh, it's so glorious. Let's go in and see what we can find in this awesome Spirit Halloween store. Oh, thank God for air conditioning. It's like 95 degrees out there right now. All right, guys, I am so excited to see what this store has in store. In front and center, we have Lord Raven, AKA Lord Farquaad. I do see a lot of other animatronics in here, but first I wanna go in here and see if I can find those ghost face masks that I've been searching for. All right, let's go to the ghost face section. Uh, I mean, they have the basic ghost face masks over here. A lot of times you'll find them in the kids section, so we're gonna look over there. Ooh, I'm getting excited at everything I see in here, guys. Just give me a minute, let me look for these masks, and then we'll get down to it. Where are you, ghost face? Where are you lurking? You again. Are you gonna tell me this time? You could tell me in a secret. One of these days you will talk, my friend. I can't find Ghostface, but I did find this humorous. Ray, this is Walter. Crap, I seriously don't see any, guys. That's disappointing, but let's go back up to the front and look at some of these animatronics. There's inflatables, and we'll come back to them, too. Let's go back through the entrance and begin with Lord Farquaad. Before we even get him going, I just want to take a closer look at that face. Look at that. Look at the nose hole. <laughs> that is a one-of-a-kind nose hole. And look at these hands. I know I say it in every video, but I just love them. Do the chickens have large talons? All right, let's get him going here. Lord Raven. I just love this guy so much. I know I say it in every video and get ready because I'm filming at least a hundred spirit stores this year, but he's just so awesome. Look, he kind of looks like a nun. All right, the music's loud in this spot, so let's go on back here. We have some more set up before we get to the ones that are on the floor. Mr. Grimm. Now, and I don't know if I told you guys this or not yet, but I just bought a 12-foot skeleton from Home Depot. I cannot wait to get him set up. And if you guys give me enough likes, I'll set him up in a video. Let's get Grimm going here. Ah, you look like death warmed over, my friend. I know. This is good. Soon there will be enough of us. And we will terrorize the living until we own this night. If I just had endless funds, I'd have about a hundred of him terrorizing my front yard for Halloween night. Let's not ignore the hanging skulls here. Those look so awesome. They don't really even have a place in a laboratory unless they're the skulls of the specimens that died. All right, let's come over here and check out the bog zombie. Let's get a close up of his face. Look at this, look at the eyes on him. That face is so creepy. All right, let's get him going here. I like this guy so much. When you're looking at these things online, they don't look half as good as they do in person. Look, when you look at him from the side, you can see just how flat his nose is. 
I gotta be careful when the speakers are right here because I could get a copyright strike. This is a super long song too, but here we have Shorty and I'm gonna turn him on in just a second. And while we're at it, some people wanted me to give up. What are those? Okay, this is a super long song, but maybe Shorty will drown him out. He's got one of the biggest heads I've seen on an animatronic. Next to Monty, of course. I'd have to compare him to see who has the bigger head. Shorty or Monty? You guys tell me what you think. Who do you think has the bigger head, Shorty or Monty? Wow, they got Monty turned down like way low. But let's back up and take a quick look at him here because he's so awesome. I love how he's standing on the box. Monty is so cool. Another thing I love is that like, Look at the step pads this year. They're all decorated, or at least Monty's is, and there's a banana on there. Yes, they're playing music from The Nightmare Before Christmas. I love when they play music like this in here, instead of like Justin Bieber and stuff like that. It's so much more Halloween-y and spooky. All right, let's look at some of the animatronics they have on the floor for sale, because these guys are pretty well stocked. Look at this, they have a bog zombie and they have another bog zombie, and I'm really surprised to see the second store with a Mr. Dark. I thought he would be really, really difficult to find this year, but there he is, peering out from the bog. And over here we have a nozzles on the top, a hot nozzles. We got a grim down here, another grim as we circle around, another Grim as we circle around. A bunch of people keep asking me if I'm gonna get Grim. I really do hope to this year. And there is another Nozzles. And what's this? Oh, we got a berry on the bottom. Berry's been buried on the bottom. Okay, let's go this way. They have a couple of sitting scarecrows here, a whole bunch of sinister spirit dolls. Here's the one with a white face and black eyes. And this one's like the evil doll that just woke up and realized she's evil. Then over here we have a handful more of the sitting scarecrows. We have another berry on the bottom. We have another berry on the bottom and we have another berry on the bottom. Okay, we have some more set up back here. Holy crap. I'm not taking another step. Look at this. I've never seen it before. The Frankenstein sidestepper. Holy crap, guys. I can't stand it. He's got a button on his foot. Come on, Frankie. Come on, Frankie. This is an atrocity that none of them are working. Okay, they either need batteries or they have one of those things that you're supposed to pull out um, from the battery compartment that makes it work, but I can't find any. So we just have to look at him and imagine what he does. We have some Sam sidesteppers here. None of these are turning on. This is an atrocity. Oh, here we go with the uh, Billy Butcherson. At least he works. But man, I would love to see Frankie in action. Okay, we'll come back to those. Let's keep moving here because there are plenty of animatronics still to be seen, including this one right here. Lord Raven, which they have only one of them, but he is in stock, so that's cool. We got a whole bunch of the empty soul girl on a swing. I would love it if among these I would find a little skelly bones like the old one where he's swinging. Mr. Dark just jumped over here and scared the living crap out of an old lady. I'm sorry, old lady, for calling you an old lady, a senior citizen. Holy crap, that was funny. All right, let's go over here and look at these animatronics, because look at this. I'm blown away. They have two Evelyn leeches. And on the other side, they have a bag of bones. And look at this. We have a couple of night crawlers here. I need to get a Nightcrawler. I keep saying I'm gonna buy one and I haven't yet. They have a whole bunch of the fogging skull pile. Look at this. Whoa, what in the world? Something is wrong. 85 bucks reduced price for Lucky Bottoms. I wonder what happened to him that he's only 85 bucks. That's half price. Half price for half a body. Maybe it's because he doesn't have a butt. And under Mr. Buttless, we have the Full Monty. All you young children won't get that one, but your parents will. They have the experimental tunnel blocked off, so we won't be getting our face electrocuted today, but they do have some other animatronics set up over here, starting with the black and red jumping spider. Come on, mister. There you go. Oops, you need to turn a little bit. There you go. And then, of course, we have Mr. Dark. He is definitely one of my favorites of all time. All right, let's get him going here. Oh, there you go. Whoa. 
Look at that, he screamed at me before he even jumped. Maybe it's because I was all up in his face. I didn't mean to be all up in your face. And beside him, we have the bag of bones. See if he'll jump. There he is. That was pretty quick, actually. Excuse me, sir, you're being very loud when I'm trying to talk to your buddy, Mr. Bones. All right, let's try that one more time here. Yes. He is really loud, and that was really fast, and I love how the green light illuminates him. All right, we got Mr. Buttless here, Lucky Bottoms. Let's get him going here if he's gonna go. Come on, Mr. Lucky. Apparently, he's not gonna go. All right, that's a bummer. Maybe they just don't have him plugged in yet. Oh my gosh, this is hilarious. Look at Nozzles. Look at the hair on him. Every store we go into, his hair looks totally different. He looks like a 90s thrasher with that hairdo. All right, let's get him going here. Come on, Nozzles. I can't get enough of this stuff. I wish he had the fog going, but he is still pretty cool. For some reason, now I'm hungry for stuffed jalapenos. <laughs> oh my god, I crack myself up. And that hairdo just gets me. You guys gotta start taking pictures of all the nozzles in your stores, and let's start comparing the hairdos. Oh, I just saw him over here fixing Lucky Bottoms. Let's see if we can get him going. There he goes. Lucky Bottoms. I wish he was turned up a little bit more, but he is the craziest laugher ever. All right, let's see. We got a couple more things over here. We have some stuffed dummies, the pose and stay skeleton. Looks like that's it for this pile. Look at this. With Nozzle's hairdo, he needs to be wearing these sunglasses in this shirt. Rad! Look at this little Jack Skellington ceramic planter. That is pretty cool. You just put a little plant in there. Oh, somebody was telling me that I need to look at the Chuckies. They have two Chuckies here in stock. These are pretty good looking, except for his face is a little bit flat for me. Oh, are you enjoying your skull dinner? Look, he's like, I've pecked it clean, but there's got to be one more piece of meat on here. We used to have skin, too. All right, let's look at all the hanging skeletons here, because this is just an awesome sight right here already. How many do we got? Six on here. And there must be 12 on the other one, but isn't it cool to just walk through and see a ton of hanging skeletons? All right, let's look at the zombie babies here. Right next to the chains of death. And they have our favorite, the burrito baby. Now I want Taco Bell. We have Creeping Death, Spider Biter Billy, Snackin' Stevie, Ravenous Ruby, and I think that's all. Just a whole bunch of those. Of course, they have this strange baby head on a stick. That is the strangest feeling baby head I've ever squeezed. <laughs> no, he didn't. Yes, he did. I think this guy's going crazy. Yes, he did. He is. Hook to the head, hook to the eye, arrow to the skull, and double face guy. Guys, Marion would kill me if I went out to the Hummer and I had this with me. But he's definitely one of my new favorites. Look at that guy. He just looks like he loves to keep secrets. <laughs> All right, we'll leave you there for now, but one of these days, my friend. All right, let's leave you some stickers here. And we'll leave some for you babies. And let's put some in these trick-or-treat bags here. Unsuspecting trick-or-treaters will get a free sticker. Here's some for the jumping spiders. Here's some for Shorty. Here's some for Grim. Here's some for Monty. I almost tripped. And here's some for Lord Farquaad. Look what we just found, guys. I was almost ready to leave. And here he is, dead by daylight, ghost face. See, this is like, this is a kid's costume. But the cool thing would be the mask. That's a hard one to find. I'm gonna hold off because all I really want is the mask. So if you want one of these dead by daylights, ghost face, get on down here.